Welcome to Galco TV. Today I will demonstrate how to crimp wires. Crimping means to join two pieces of metal together by deforming one or both of them to hold the other. The resulting deformity is what is known as the crimp. In order to crimp connectors onto a wire, you will need a dedicated crimping tool. Note that tools not dedicated to crimping, such as pliers, should not be used as they will not create the proper cold weld that a crimping specific tool will. A poor crimp can leave air pockets between the wire and connector. These air pockets can allow moisture to collect, resulting in eventual corrosion and ultimately leading to connection failure. You may need to strip away part of the insulation at the end of the wire before you can begin the crimping process. To do so, place the end of the wire into the proper hole of your stripping tool, ensuring that you will have enough exposed wire to fit your desired connector. Then clamp down and pull the insulation away to reveal the bare wire inside. Now that you have the end of the wire exposed, twist it with your thumb and finger to make the end more firm and to allow for a more positive connection for the connector. Proceed to insert the wire into the connector until the insulation on the wire touches the end of the barrel. Then insert the wire and terminal into the crimper. If your crimping tool features colored markings, match the insulation with the color on your crimping tool. If the crimping tool does not have colored markings, you will want to use the gauge markings on the side of the tool. Then, squeeze the tool with considerable force. After completing the crimp, the wire and connector should remain held together even under force. If the connection can be pulled apart by hand, then the crimp was done improperly. It is preferable to have the crimp fail at this point rather than after being installed, so it is recommended to test before implementing. For more on wires and thousands of other products and services, head over to galco.com.